here on YouTube, right here on Dad's Kitchen. We about to be whipping up some braised short ribs in the oven for y'all. Some real nice and bomb, you know what I mean? If you love short ribs, then here's the place to be. Follow me. Get over here. Let's wash my hands, baby. We finna get it popping up here in Dad's Kitchen. So what's going on with y'all though out here? Hope everybody having a blessed, beautiful day. You know, it's one o'clock, and I'm about to start whipping these short ribs up. Little lunch, you know what I mean? It's gonna take a minute, but we're gonna get it going, baby. You know what I'm saying? Soak these hands up real good, and everything gonna be wonderful. You feel me? Check it out, though. Hold on. Let me grab my cutting board, and I'm gonna show y'all what we work with. Let me grab something to dry my hands off first. And uh, I'm gonna show y'all what we work with. Get on! Yeah, so uh, first thing first, baby. Of all, I've got these short ribs right here. We finna wash off. Y'all see that? Y'all with me? Y'all with me? Is y'all with me? Nice, beautiful red texture to them. So we finna wash them off. And um, we got some celery we finna cut up. We got some mashed potatoes. I'm gonna make them quick. So them is the instant ones. You know, I don't, I don't got time to be doing all that. We got some Worcestershire sauce. We got some carrots, and we got a yellow onion. And uh, we got some beef broth. I'm not using chicken broth. Some people use chicken broth, but I don't. We're going to use beef broth on these short ribs right here. My partner was like, man, won't you do some short ribs? I had a couple partners actually ask me to do some. So I'm going to do them, you know what I'm saying? And uh, we're going to see how they come out, you know what I'm saying? Because everything I touch uh, come out bomb right here. On Dad's Kitchen, you feel me? So we just going to the wildlife cabinet and uh, grabbing some of these magical seasonings out that I got, you know? And uh, get this cutting board, you know what I'm saying? So everything is everything. Let's watch these meat, leave this meat off real quick. Hold on, guys. Yeah. Wash these off. Throw these up in here real quick. We don't want nobody talking about me. Uh, he used this sink. Did you see him use this sink? Shut the heck up, bro. Y'all don't know how clean my house is or how I clean. You know what I'm saying? If you got some bad comments, leave them to yourself because we don't need them right here on Dad's Kitchen. You feel me? So get over here while we watch this meat. You know? Ain't nobody got time for all that, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get y'all some good cooking and some nice, beautiful, uh, you know, food, you know, so y'all can grub, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get y'all something for y'all can grub on, man. You know, so just wash them off real good. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna wash them off, and we're gonna throw these on that cutting board, season them up. And uh, what you wanna do is you wanna preheat this oven, guys. We're gonna go 350. All right? Make sure ain't nothing in there. Nothing in there. We're gonna go 350, baby. You know what I'm saying? And uh, we finna just. Man, we finna have these pop in. These, I ain't had these in a minute neither. So uh, they should just come out just right and beautiful, man. You know what I'm saying? Because everything, dad kitchen, cook, come out, bum. You feel me? It comes out, bum. You feel me? So uh, that's that, hold on. Let me set y'all down real quick. And uh, we just gonna season these up. We gonna leave that, we gonna leave a little fat on. We ain't trimming nothing. Cause we, we, we don't care about that, you know what I'm saying? What we care about is the flavor. That's what we care about. And you just wanna season them up, right? With the lorries. You're going lorries, right? We gonna go garlic salt, or you can go garlic powder. Depending on how your sodium intake is, you know, mine's all right, thank God. You know, I ain't got no problem with high blood pressure or nothing, so, you know, I'm good. I bless, I'm blessed off of that. Thank you, Jesus. And uh, we're gonna go a little paprika. We're gonna go a little paprika for a little color to them. You know what I'm saying? Put a little paprika. <gasps> oh, that did not just happen. Oh, 
Hold on, guys. So yeah, guys, if that ever happened to you, <laughs> just rinse the meat off and uh, just keep seasoning all over again. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Don't say that ain't never happened to y'all, please. Who, hey, hey, I know y'all probably laughing at me like this dude, crazy, bro. Like. Don't say that ain't never happened to y'all, cause I'm sure that it happened to plenty of us, man. The ones, the ones that's cook, that cook, been cooking for years, man. You know what I'm saying? So don't even trip, man. You know we go, we we still keeping it popping. I ain't gonna even edit that out, baby. I was gonna cut it out and act like that never even happened, but you know I ain't gonna even do that, baby. So now we're going lemon pepper, right? And uh, guys, what we gonna do right here, right? A little more of that cayenne, right? So now, what we gonna do, guys? Hold on, let me wash my hands. What we gonna do is uh, we about to get a frying pan out, right? And uh, what we gonna do? We gonna we gonna sear these a little bit, man. You know what I'm saying? We're about to sear these. About to sear these on up, baby. Get some olive oil. So get over here. What you want to do, guys? Right? Get you some olive oil, right? Or a little cooking grease if you don't got olive oil. And uh, we just want to brown these, man, a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead, finish that off. I got another one up there. Let that get hot. And, uh, yeah, guys, <laughs> that was a trip, man. You know, that didn't happen to me several times, you know what I'm saying? Especially on Thanksgiving when I'm just moving fast and, you know, doing this, doing that, and trying to, man, because it, it's hard cooking on Thanksgiving when you buy, when you just, you're the only cook and you buy yourself. You know what I'm saying? You got to stay up all night with the, man, this, man, it's a lot to it, man. So, you know. But uh, what we gonna do now, guys, is uh, what we gonna do, I want y'all to get some Worcestershire sauce, right? I want y'all to grab y'all some Worcestershire sauce and just you know, dump, dump that Worcestershire sauce on there, man. You know, flavor these things up, baby. You know, they need a little love, too. You ain't got Worcestershire sauce? Put some soy sauce, all right? That's what I'm gonna need y'all to do. You ain't got Worcestershire sauce? I want you to put some soy sauce, okay? Don't be like, that's too much salt. Be quiet. No, it's not. You can get low sodium soy sauce. They got it. You know, they got Miss Dash for people that can't see, that can't eat the seasoning, you know what I'm saying? So, they got substitute stuff. Man, they got all kinds of stuff out there, man, seasonings, man. So, you know, we just gonna brown this meat. And, uh, I'm gonna start cutting these vegetables up and I'm gonna get back to y'all in a minute. I'm gonna show y'all when, when this meat start browning. Peace. So yeah, guys, what you wanna do is just, you just wanna just, Dump these, uh, dump these short ribs in here. We just gonna fry them up, right? All on every side. Fry them up. I'm gonna fry them up on every side, you guys. Let them cook, brown. And, uh, man, oh my goodness. I can smell that already. That's always, uh, that Worcestershire sauce with all that bomb seasoning. Oh my goodness, guys, it's going down right here at that chicken. Y'all ain't know it, it's going down, baby. So you just wanna turn these over when they brown, guys, all right? So you let these brown on it, all sides. Oven already preheated, and uh, it's going down here on Dad's kitchen, baby. It's going down, short ribs for lunch, man. 
And I'm gonna serve this over some mashed potatoes, cheesy mashed potatoes, with a little gravy over it. And uh, you guys are gonna see that finished results on that. Because Dad's Kitchen, we do a live, baby, step by step right here. Sorry I didn't show y'all to chop up the veggie, but I'm kinda in a rush. Gotta pick the kids up in a little bit. So, you know, I'm kinda pressing with time. But it's all good. We, we do our thing right here on Dad's Kitchen. If those that's been subscribed and true, and been down with us, the Kareem family in Dad's Kitchen, man, I love y'all, baby. I love y'all to the fullest. Utmost love, utmost respect. I love y'all, for real. Now, we are gonna just flip these, right? Mm -mm -mm. See that brown? They already browning, guys. You just wanna flip this. Get them brown on all, all sides, right? Man, that smells bomb, guys, I'm gonna let me show y'all. Let me show y'all when I say brown. See that? Do you see that? Okay, okay, okay. And uh, so let's get them brown, baby. Get them brown all the way around. Get them brown all the way around. Yeah, man. And uh, yeah. So. When these is finished, done browning all the way around. I'm going to take you on the next step right here on Dad's Kitchen. Hey. All right, guys. So now, these is browned all around. So, I'm going to get a plate or something to put these on. Because uh, we're going to take you on the next step. Man, it smells so fun and delicious, guys. And they ain't even done yet. Watch when they come out that oven, how bomb they going to be and how tender. Oh my goodness, guys, I can't wait. So you just want to just grab all these out, right? Okay, that's that, right? Just want to keep that same oil, right, guys? And we're just going to add the veggies in there. You want to go onion first? Or whatever, it's onion, celery. I'm just going to dump it all in there. If you want to back up off that uh, heat, though. Turn it down a little bit and let that oil cool down. Cause I cooked that on high. So I got the oil a little cold. And uh veggies is in. We finna saute these babies up. And uh we got another thing we finna put up in there, guys. You know what I'm saying? We can't forget the fresh what? We can't forget the fresh what, guys? We can't forget the fresh what? The fresh garlic. You got to have a garlic, baby. You got to have a garlic. All right. I'm gonna need y'all to grab some garlic. Dump some garlic up in there, baby. Cause the garlic gonna make miracles to this dish. Please believe me. So we got the celery, the onion, the garlic up in here. And uh, man, that smells so delicious. Mmm, mmm, God. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, guys. And what, what I'm going to need you guys to do now. I'm going to need you guys to add one more thing in there, guys. So we just sauteing these up. Uh, what we gonna do now, guys? Hold on for a minute. I want y'all to put some carrots up in there, right? Or you can add them last, but you can follow my step, it'll come out better. Then next, we're gonna go with some beef broth. Some people use chicken broth, but I'm going with the beef broth. Okay? Follow Dad's directions, baby. You want it Bond's way, do it Dad's way. Alright? You want it the Bond's way? Do it dad's way. Okay? Now, what we gonna do, guys? We about to get some flour, right? So I just wanna add a little flour to this. Add a little flour. It's gonna be like a gravy you about to make. So you got the oil in there, right? Just a little bit. Okay? Got that flour. Now, what you want to do, guys, right? You, know, 
yard. What is he doing? Just pay attention. Pay attention, guys. Now we're gonna add that beef broth. We're gonna let that cook a little bit. Kinda want that flour to cook a little bit to get a little brown. And then uh, we're gonna add that beef broth. Some people use red wine, but we don't have none right now, so we ain't worried about that, okay? So, again, you got that flour in there, and you just wanna pour some of this beef broth, okay? And just keep stirring like that. Get all that, oh yeah. Okay, now, you wanna pour the beef broth because this beef broth, right, is gonna give it that more of that flavor you need. It's gonna kick it off, okay? Oh man, this is gonna be bun. This is gonna be bun. So we're just gonna bring that to a boil and I'm gonna show y'all the next step right here on Dad's Kitchen. Pay attention, baby, cause it's going down right here on Dad's Kitchen. Follow me. I'll be back in the hot flash. So yeah, this is coming to a boil, guys. And you just wanna make sure you scrape, get that bottom because, you know, I felt a little bit of uh, their short ribs from braising them. You know what I'm saying? So you see that gravy? I just whipped up, look at that gravy. Look, it's beautiful, baby. This is gonna be so delicious. Let me show y'all. Get over here, see that? Just let it come to a boil, all right? And guys, what we gonna do, we gonna go with a bigger pot, right? Because these short ribs, you just dump them short ribs in with all that juice, look at that. See that? And you see that, right? Now. This is what we gonna do. We gonna lay these down flat. Lay these short ribs down, right? And uh, we gonna go 300 on the oven because I wanna slow cook these for y'all. So when y'all see me eat these, you guys will see how tender these things gonna be. So we gonna go to 300. I want y'all to go 300, right? You see that at a boil? This is my this is my gravy, baby. And this is going down, it's going all right here. Check this out, look how beautiful and lovely that's gonna be. Look how beautiful that's gonna be, guys. Tell me, tell me that, tell me that's not gonna be beautiful. Tell me that it's gonna be beautiful and bomb. And you see, you see the juice? And it's gonna make more juice cause we are gonna go with the top on there, right? You need a cast iron or, you know, you don't have a top, uh, a top to bake in. You, you put some foil over a top, anything. You can use anything. Just close him up, right? And we're gonna go in this oven. Yeah, guys, so you wanna cook that on there for, on 300 real slow for like, give it like two good hours, guys, cause you want it to be nice and tender and really cooked. And uh, y'all, the finished results right here on Dad's Kitchen and what we working with on these short ribs, baby. Cause like I said, nobody does it better than Dad's Kitchen, you feel me? So. If y'all new here, I want y'all to like, subscribe, and comment down below. And uh, give me some comments, man. Leave some comments, man. You know, because I, like I said, I love to cook, man. You know, y'all want me to cook something? I'll be happy to do it, man. Just leave a comment. Let me know what's going on, man. All right, All right guys. So we done with this. Let's go on and take him out and see how we looking up in here. Right here on Dad's Kitchen. Nobody does it better, baby. Oh my goodness, guys. We got the mashed potatoes. Oh my goodness, guys. God, hold on, man. Let me turn that, let me get that extra lighting on that. You see, do you see them ribs falling off their bones, though? Do you see the ribs falling? Look, here go a bone right here, guys. Yeah, be my, my witness right there. Look at that. That's how tender your short ribs is supposed to be. Pull apart like that with a fork, then your ribs is tender, baby. Oh my goodness. And there you have it, right here. Nobody does it better 
than Dad's Kitchen, baby. Nobody does it better than Dad's Kitchen. I'm about to show y'all the finished results right here when I lay this out on my plate, and I want y'all to see how bomb this look. And share this video, cause it's going down right here on the Kareem family, right here on Dad's Kitchen. We ain't playing up in Dad's Kitchen, baby. You know what I'm saying? It's a once in a lifetime cook like me, man. You know what I'm saying? So pay attention and learn something. Follow me, all right? I'll be back in a sec. Peace. And there you have it, guys. No one does it better than Dad's Kitchen. No one does it better than Dad's Kitchen, guys. We ain't playing up in here. Hey, you guys, come eat. Kid. No one does it better than Dad's Kitchen, guys. Look at that beautiful meal. All the way around. You see that sauce? That roux, baby? You see that roux? It's going down right here in Dad's kitchen. It's going down. Oh my goodness, guys. Let me show y'all this. Give me a good thumbnail of this. Where's my Beautiful plate? dish. Why didn't you make my There's plate? Sam, guys. What you mean, make your plate? Oh Where's my goodness. My, where's my plate? Hold on, let me finish this thumbnail. Oh my goodness, guys. Dude, I'm hungry now. This is heck good. It smells good. Oh, it's, and it's bomb, too. I bet everything you cook is bomb. I don't know, baby. Dad's kitchen. Dad's kitchen right here. Say it one more time, baby. Dad's kitchen. That's right. Ugh. <laughs> Going down. There's short ribs over there. Some mashed potatoes on the plate. Just throw them on there. Put some. Oh my goodness, guys. All right, this camera's whacking out of the focus, guys. I don't know what's wrong with it, but I'm about to grub. And uh, if y'all want to see more of my videos, all you got to do is go to the Kareem family, guys, and go to the playlist, and you'll see Dad's Kitchen. Press on that Dad's Kitchen, and you'll get about 40-some videos so far. And as like I say, we're going to keep them coming. And to all the ones that's been down with us, and stuck by us and been down with us and keep watching our videos and showing love and support and commenting. We love y'all. We love all y'all, all right? Y'all wanna say bye? Say bye to the vlog. See ya. Bye. Peace.